Welcome to the Tech Me Show. Today I'm going to teach you how to get rid of those Google tasks that are running in the background. I hate it. Um, <laughs> cuz I don't use Chrome all the time. Um, so and Google doesn't give you the option to stop this junk and it really upsets me. So I did some investigating. Uh, actually when I was making my other video with the sync toy, I found out where Google is a little sneaky here. Okay, uh, so let's go ahead and uh, open up your task scheduler like I have. Don't know how to do that? Let's go ahead and close this. Go to Start, All Programs, Accessories, System Tools, and then go ahead and select Task Scheduler. I said that very weird, didn't I? <laughs> Nonetheless, let's go ahead and scroll down. Oh, what do you know? Google Update Task Machine UA. Let's go ahead and double click that. You see this? This upsets me. This really upsets me. <laughs> you know, this fear mongering that they say, oh, it'll keep you update and whatnot. Well, to me, I don't even know what this thing does. For all I know, it's a really a system uh, task logger. Um, you know, they've been caught doing things. Look at this. After every hour. No, 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 no. That is not going to be continued. See, Google update. You ever wonder when you do the task manager, what in the world is this? Well, Look, they even disabled the history. <laughs> so, you might be asking, let's go ahead and disable this thing and delete it. No, we're not going to delete it. Uh, but we are going to end it. Yes, we do. Now we're going to click disable. Now we've disabled this thing. Now we won't get stuck doing these updates. Now, you should make a task to remember that, hey, uh, it's been 10 days. Turn this back on and let Google do its thing. Or constantly check the Google blog. I'm sure they uh, update Chrome updates there. It is their baby, and they're hoping it's going to be the best thing since sliced bread, which they didn't get me yet. Um, but I do have clients who need add-ons for it. Nonetheless, let's go back. Let it populate. Okay, now we have another one from Google. Gosh, when will they end, right? So, we're going to go ahead and disable this. Why this is, uh, let's go ahead and click end, yes, and then disable. Now that's disabled. Now, please take note of what you're doing. Um, you really only need the other Google updater. Um, now let's go ahead and go to the Google Update Task Machine Core. Let's go to Actions. And again, Google Update. This is getting ridiculous. Let's go ahead and select End. End. Go ahead and select Disable. Disable. Now let's go to the next Google one. I'm sure there's probably a million more. Uh, only one big one I see here. Another one. Let's go ahead and select it. Let's go to Actions. Yes. Google Update again. Wow. When will they end? So, select End. Yes. Disable. Now, you might be asking, well, Lance, what if it's not loaded? You know what? Just select End, just in case something might be using it. Just in case. And then press Disable. And again, if you want to re-enable it, you just select it. I'm not even going to re-enable it. Because uh, it probably re-enabled everything else. Now, if we see here, disabled, 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 disabled. Now, we could go through the list and see what else Google's loading, Microsoft and whatnot. But that's really all I wanted to check out today. Um, and here's one for the Tech Me Show. Let's go ahead and select that. Uh, I made a test where it did the sync toy. Um, you could go ahead and check that out. Um, I hope that you would check out that tutorial, but I'm going to go ahead and select end, disable, and I'm actually going to select delete. And that should do it. 
uh, I hope that this video was useful to you. I'm sorry that I made you see me uh, delete my own uh, uh, task that I created from the other show. But I hope this was useful. Uh, I know people do wonder, how do I get rid of that updater? And now you know. Thank you again for watching the Tech Me Show.